this video I'm going to show you how to use the Pitch Shift plugin in Pro Tools 8. It's really simple and there's many different things you can do in it. Let's check it out. To open up the Pitch Shift plugin in Pro Tools is quite simple. Just go over to the audio suite, scroll down to Pitch Shift, go over, scroll down to Pitch Shift again, click. Here you are though. The, um, the Pitch Shift plugin in Pro Tools. This is really great for taking an instrument track or a vocal track that came out of tune and put it back into key or just to change the overall tonality of a track. You can use this and where it's great for both functions. Okay, so first thing you need to do is make sure that you have selected the region that you want this plugin to affect. It can be the whole region or it can also just be part of region, that's up to you. Since this isn't very large, I'm just gonna select the whole vocal track. And first remember, there's two different sections in here. The one that works more with with uh, keys, then over here, which is more like chorus, ratio, crossfade, whatnot. So the level sh affects how loud the um, these le levels are, whereas the gain affects how loud the rest of these levels are in th in the plugin. Okay, so first let's just listen to the vocal track before it's affected. Hey, hey. All right, and so now let's just let's just bring my voice down just a little bit. Select the region, click process. Now let's listen. Hey, hey, hey. See, it's brought down, but not too much. You can also bring it down in keys, like I said before. Right now it's at A4. Let's bring it down to F sharp 3. Select the region again. Hit process, you're gonna have to do that every time, just make sure you remember that. See a bit more, maybe a bit too much. So just simple, just bring it back up. But don't worry too much about having it selected because as you see it'll just remind you. I'll click process without selecting it. This is gonna pop up, no audio was selected. So just click the region process. And you can also get like really, really funky sounds too and make turn the vocals into a little bit of a sound effect too, if you will. Drop a bit more. Turn that. Click on the region. Just solo that since it's a little quiet. And as you can tell, it can be a lot of fun, but can also be a very helpful tool. If one of your, if one word in your vocal track comes out of key, you can just select that one word. Use this, uh, use the pitch shift plugin, and boom, you're all good to go.